Warning, this video contains shocking jokes about beavers. If you are a beaver, if you have a beaver, or you just identify as a beaver, you have been warned. We are in Manaka, Pennsylvania, and uh, we're going to be fishing the beaver today. The Ohio River, but we're definitely going to play around in the beaver today, so we'll see what happens. Hopefully we smack a few smallmouth, and I, I don't even know if there's walleye in here or not, but I don't know. We're definitely going to give that beaver some hell today. So. We're at the Beaver River. It smells a little fishy at the Beaver. Man, that's not what I was gonna say. Well, we're off. I'm kind of liking this little bridge here. Yeah. Let's see what we see. I'm showing the... bait and everything. Let's let's give it a little try here. Let's see what happens. Right now we're just checking out this bridge, seeing if we can pick up some sort of fish. Frank's working two rods. You got a shiner on one, and what are you using for the other, Frank? And right now I just have a uh, fathead minnow. On a jig head. Frank. The infamous sheephead. Do you need a net? They fight good though. I, I wouldn't mind catching one of them. Seriously, look, it's a good fight. You want the net? Nah. I'm gonna lift them. some drag. <laughs> That's pretty nice. <laughs> Let me get a picture. I don't know if you can see down in there. Like its tongue has like teeth on it in the back of its throat. Oh, wow. 
What'd you catch that on, Frank? Got it on a Ned rig. On the uh, Z-Man Craw, I guess uh, the color's called the Veal. Uh, got a little light blue on the back of it. Well, so far, one fish, a sheephead. So I think we're done uh, playing around at the uh, the entry of the beaver here. I think it's time to go deep into the beaver. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go hard into the beaver. Sometimes I guess. Uh, you can have some gas in your beaver. And this is where it's at, right here. Gas on the beaver. I got one. Nice. A walleye! Ooh, walleye! <laughs> He's still fighting. That's like. Can you handle him? He's like the best fighting walleye I've had. I better. I, wanna, I only have six pound test line on. Nice. That was on a fathead. That could be illegal fish. I don't know if it's, uh, is it, can you keep them right now? Keep them uh, freaking swallow it, huh? They're season now. Yeah, I just cut the line. Nice. Measure them. Fourteen and a half. Yeah. Almost. All right, buddy. Thank you. Nice. Nice. That's a nice one. Did, did you? Uh, that might be fifteen inches. Did you want? You want a net? Need the net? You gonna keep that one if it's legal? What's that? Are you gonna keep that one if it's legal? That's absolutely. That's pretty. Yeah, it's a neat looking fish, isn't it? Look how flat he makes his head. Nice. Looks like it's a good fish. It is. Oh, that's a big walleye, I think. You don't want to come up. That's oh, a catfish. Cat Mother after. <laughs> yeah, we don't even need to put him in a net. <laughs> no. Did he swallow? Wah, wah, wah. 
crack and swallow it there. He's quite well. Chill out. flyers are up here. I should have known when I felt like it hitting the line. You know, it was like probably rolling. Yeah. That's ah, still a fish. Yeah. yeah that was a good fight, too. That's still fighting. from ancient Egypt. With this, you can catch a million dollars worth of fish. Thanks for Jizz Wiz. You're number one. Woo wee! You do not need a magic lamp to get fishes. All you need is three fitty plus three fitty for shipping and handling. All right, guys, we're gonna try trolling through this area. I'm gonna use this hot and tot here. And Frank's gonna use that hot and tot. Frank just caught a fish. He didn't know he had it on his line. <laughs> Are you tired of catching tiny fish? <laughs> That's a really nice rock bass. That's a really nice rock bass. Real nice rock bass. Chunky little guy. 